Good day, everyone. We have come to our next project. And that next project is, in fact, something different. I am doing a little side project here. It's the um, Warhammer of the Worlds World Hollow. It's Kevik's playback. Just to do something new and try some new paint techniques. I mean, strategy, basically. And this strategy involves just starting off with a white prime coat, as you can see. And I wanted to challenge myself by fully assembling all the models and see whether I can still paint behind all these details. There we go. So, we're going to start with um, Plague Bearer Flash. I have some Warp Lightning. And I also have Elderry Emerald. But those are more for the stones and the Warp Lightning Gases. And then we have Griff Charger Grey for the other parts. So I noticed they have sort of a, a cape of sorts. I want to use that Griff Charger Grey on that, but I want their inner robe to be green. So it's a double layered. Yeah, all of them have sort of like a double layered jacket. So I'm going to do the inner layer green and then the outer layer of charger gray because they're hunting in the underworld so they need a bit of dark cloth as well so that's what we're gonna do now I'm gonna just paint straight over this we're not doing slap chop I'm just gonna practice different techniques here I'm trying something new here, a new setup. I lowered the camera a bit. Anyway, let's um, continue. Mm. Oh, I just noticed I forgot one item, but it's okay. <coughs> we'll just start with this. We're gonna go with Rattling Grime. Rattling Grime. On our on the skin of these guys.
Oops. Size up. Now we do Gillum in the flash. We are now going to apply wood lining to the stones and we got ripper flash to the clouds.
So next up, we're gonna do all their horns with Screaming Skull first. And then we're gonna touch the base with a little bit of Cyber. Or maybe Wildwood either way. We're going for no oil. <clears throat> we shall be using Administrator Ray to add some highlights to the base. skull to do the nails the, the teeth and so on and then I need to do some uh, like these, these little boils everywhere and I have decided to just go straight for blood for the blood gods it makes it nice and slimy and somewhat red I think he's the only one who has but no, no, no. Skabik himself has a few too. But uh, yeah, that's the plan for this last part. So here we go.